Hello, uh, I'm Chawad Hussain. I'm the Executive Medical Director at the East Lanks. Uh, this is my update. I was away for two weeks, especially last week was uh, the celebration of Eid. Uh, for those colleagues who were celebrating it, uh, I'm sure you had a joyous moment with your friends and families. I'm wishing you all a very belated Eid Mubarak. Last week was also on the uh, 5th of uh, May, Thursday, was the International Midwifery Day. It was celebrated at ELHT. Our midwives were uh, appreciated for the work they do. It's very hard work, as you all know. There were events held on. Uh, and there was recognition and a lot of thank yous, which was passed from various groups, patients, families, and colleagues to our midwifery staff. It is a teamwork and midwives provide a very solid foundation on delivering care for our pregnant ladies and the babies. So a big thank you from me as well to our midwives. This Thursday, 12th of uh, May 2022 is the International Nurses Day. Again, uh, we are in the process of holding celebrations and recognitions of all the hard work that our nurses uh, provide in keeping the health service going. In fact, you know, they are the spine of the service of the care that is provided to our patients so again there will be various events that will be taking place this week as a part of uh, recognition of all the work that our nurses do this week is the mental health awareness week and the theme picked up uh, by the mental health foundation is on loneliness now we have seen uh, a lot of increase in the mental health, especially because of the effect COVID had on segregation, isolation, and all that happened in the last two years. Uh, if staff are feeling lonely at work and would like to speak to someone about uh, the feelings, then your manager's door is always open. There are resources available with the well team. Uh, who can advise further on how to approach various resources. Uh, please speak to your friends, family, uh, to, to, to help express if there are any anxieties that you are feeling in regards to loneliness. There are other coping strategies, the likes of physical exercise in the outdoors, uh, and if need be, um, will be supportive in trying to contact the therapist or counsellors. Um, an update in regards to um, STAR Awards. Now, this is a recognition ceremony of colleagues who have contributed to the personal, safe and effective caring at ELHT. Uh, the nominations are open, so I would encourage uh, colleagues to nominate uh, the colleagues who they feel have gone above and beyond in helping provide the excellent care. Uh, we would also encourage uh, patients and their families to nominate the people who have looked after them. Uh, the closing date is 27th of May 2022. So please get going in your nominations. Uh, the information is available on our website. Uh, finally, the pressures on our unscheduled care remain still quite high. Uh, and as like in my previous messages, I would encourage to explore alternatives before one's decide to come to accident and emergency or urgent care. These resources are 111, your local pharmacies and your GPs. Um, I'll update you uh, in the next couple of weeks of uh, any developments that are taking place. So please look after yourself and your loved ones. Bye for now.